Thank you, yes. I can't understand how those women in the kitchen can be awake so early after the night we had. See you later, Bo. Is there anything you need? Something wrong with your tea? It is tea. I detest this stuff. But this morning, I need to shake the dreams from my mind. I may also need a favor. You just have to ask. One of my oldest friends has been captured by mages, forced into slavery. I heard the cry for help as I slept. I'd be happy to help. What did these mages use to capture your friend? Blood magic? A summoning circle, I would imagine. I'm sorry? My friend is a spirit of wisdom. Unlike the spirits clamoring to enter our world through the rifts, it was dwelling quite happily in the Fade. It was summoned against its will, and wants my help to gain its freedom and return to the Fade. I thought spirits wanted to find their way into this world. Some do, certainly. Just as many Orlesian peasants wish they could journey to exotic Ravain. But not everyone wants to go to Ravain. My friend is an explorer, seeking lost wisdom and reflecting it. It would happily discuss philosophy with you, but it had no wish to come here physically. Do you have any idea what the mages want with your friend? No. It knows a great deal of lore and history, but a mage could learn that simply by speaking to it in the Fade. It is possible that they seek information it does not wish to give, and intend to torture it. All right. Let's go get your friend. Thank you. I got a sense of my friend's location before I awoke. I'll mark it on our map. Wandering the gardens, I see. Mistress Pullen of Sarnia is accused of aiding and abetting the Red Templars in the Dales. She sold a quarry to them for a handsome sum. They used the quarry to grow red lyrium by enslaving townspeople. The only extenuating circumstance, Mistress Pullen was procuring supplies to keep the remaining townspeople fed. Can't ignore your crimes, but it seems you had a noble purpose. 
My crime was misjudgment. The land sale was meant to bring prosperity in hard times. Surely it was clear you were selling to the enemy. We were starving, and they told me they'd reopen the mines. Selling the quarry so hastily was a mistake. I did what I could to rectify it. I can't let you go free, but I can give you an honest living. Mr. Spoolin, I sentence you to work as a scribe of the Inquisition. Half your wages will go to the town of Sarnia. A drudge? On this cold rock? <sighs> as you command. The order was sent? This morning. Let us begin. All right. what we have.
Inquisitor. At least the walk back will be easier than the walk up.
kill. Her. 